New York City's iconic Flatiron building has been sitting vacant for years while its five owners have been deadlocked in a dispute over how to reposition the building. While the owners began updating the elevators, stairwells, and opening up the floors, four of the owners considered converting it to a hotel, while the fifth owner, Nathan Silverstein, wanted to divide up the property and sell it off. The dispute went to court where the judge forced the property to go to auction, which also happened in 1933 when the owners defaulted and it sold for $100,000. On March 22, Jacob Garlick, an unknown in the New York real estate scene, won with a high bid of $190 million. The second highest bid was from Jeffrey Gurrell, one of the four owners pushing for the hotel conversion. Gurrell said, I was totally shocked that somebody would bid so much money for the building. It's a beautiful building, but not really worth that much. Jacob failed to pay the 10% deposit by March 24th and backed out of the purchase. Subscribe to find out what happens next.